Hi everyone! Did you miss any multi-device updates at Google I.O. this year? Don't worry. In the next 90 seconds, I'll recap the top three things that you should know. First, large screen updates. There are two new Android devices coming from Pixel, the Pixel Fold and the Pixel Tablet. With these joining the 280 million active large screen Android devices, it's a great time to invest in optimizing your app for larger screens. We've released a few things to make this easy. We have improved tools and guidance, like the new Pixel Fold and Pixel Tablet emulator configurations in Android Studio. We also have expanded material design updates, and we've created more galleries with inspiration for building apps for larger screens. Second, we released the developer preview of Wear OS 4. This release comes with many exciting changes, including a new way to build watch faces. The new watch face format is a declarative XML format that allows you to configure the appearance and behavior of watch faces. The Wear OS platform takes care of the logic needed to render the watch face so you can focus on your creative ideas rather than code optimizations or battery performance. Finally, Compose for TV is released in alpha. Jetpack Compose already had mobile components, Wear OS components, and widgets, and now TV components. So now you can use the same foundational Jetpack Compose APIs for TV as well. This makes it easy to build beautiful, functional apps for Android TV OS. OK, those were our top hits in 90 seconds. Want to learn more? Check out the full playlist on multi-device from Google I.O. in the description.